देखिए आपने सीज फायर से शुरू करता हूं मैंने नहीं कहा कि सीज फायर है मैं कह रहा हूं सीज फायर के बिना मुश्किल लग रहा है क्योंकि वहां पे अभी शेलिंग चल रही है यहां पे कांटेक्ट है जब कांटेक्ट कह रहा हूं दोनों दोनों आर्मियों के बीच में वो डिवाइडिंग लाइन है तो कांटेक्ट पॉइंट्स अगर होते हैं तो दिक्कत हो जाती है तो हम अगर सीज फायर रहे हम नहीं चाहते कि हमारे स्टूडेंट्स ऐसी जगह से क्रॉस करें जहां पर उनके कोई रिस्क आए वॉर जोन में आपको मालूम नहीं कुछ भी हो सकता है इसीलिए हम हमेशा अपने स्टूडेंट्स के ऐसे चाहेंगे ऐसा कोई सेफ रूट निकले तो ये इंपॉर्टेंट है तो आ, मुझे सीज फायर के बारे में हमारी गुजारिश ये रहेगी कि दोनों पक्षों को हम कह चुके हैं पब्लिकली कि कोई सीज फायर हो लोकल सीज फायर हो ताकि हम अपने स्टूडेंट्स को निकाल सके ये तो हम दोनों साइड को कह रहे हैं शिंजो यू आस्ट हाउ मेनी अमित अदर पार्ट ऑफ योर क्वेश्चन वॉज हाउ मेनी इन खार्की हाउ मेनी इन सुमी लेट मी रिपीट वट आई स्टार्टेड आवर एस्टिमेट इज खार्की टाउन और सिटी वुड हैव अराउंड थ्री ओके सुमी समथिंग 700 प्लस एंड पिसोचन वी स्टार्टेड ऑफ विथ अराउंड 900 800 समथिंग 900 अराउंड फाइव बस लोड्स हैव लेफ्ट वी मोर बसेस आर एक्सपेक्टेड आई विल शेयर विथ यू अपडेट वंस वी हैव बेटर फिक्स ऑन हाउ मेनी आर लेफ्ट ओके लुक लेट मी सी हाउ बिग द बसेस आर वी एस्टिमेट अबाउट फॉर्ट फोर्टीन बस फोर्टी टू फिफ्टी बट लेट मी नॉट गेस यू Meghna, uh, you mentioned about how many at the border and at Lviv. Look, we don't uh, we don't have a tracking system on each person. So my understanding is not too many at the. I would say uh, probably less than thousand overall in the country, other than the east who are stuck and this Pisochin. Leaving aside Pisochin, um, you know, Kharkiv and Sumy, maybe around a thousand or so who would want to. Maybe less because look, twenty thousand plus have crossed over. it doesn't matter uh, we don't see the kind of pressure at the border those who want to go uh, embassy is assisting i don't think people are just waiting in lviv Liv- Liv- because i think the polish border is reasonably open and the people are crossing or through the other borders and finally uh, polomi uh, you asked about this uh, humanitarian corridor that the talks yesterday between russia and ukraine they talk we also saw the reports um i must confess we haven't seen anything further to that in terms of implementation of the same on the ground we of course are closely and eagerly monitoring that if that happens it will certainly help our process and we have been seek asking both sides of cessation of hostilities uh, cease fire local cease fire whatever works to get our people out of conflict zones um uh, yeshi i think you asked about uh, other citizens look we have received some i, I let me go back to what we said uh, what we said here earlier we said that look if uh, we are always willing to help other countries and i think prime minister mentioned about helping uh, developing world and our neighbors Uh, and if a specific request on the ground comes we will, our approach will be based guided by that we have received some request some of it is in general and they have taken their own flights and own arrangement but a couple of places there have been specific requests uh, i just did a round of phoning before i came in i think we have had one bangladeshi national who came in um i don't i think there was perhaps uh, a nepali citizen but i have a feeling there'll be more because i know there've been some requests and they are trying to be uh you know put in the flights of course indian citizens also need to be there but i know at least one bangladeshi citizen has come and i will have to check on the others uh, what they are um there are some other requests that have come and i think we will we will try to help uh, the best we can particularly as now our pressure on uh, the indian citizens will reduce a bit